alaikum, alaikum salam. Habibi, like what I have seen. <laughs> How do you say gem? Gem. Khalas. <laughs> Finish. <laughs> I am Andre Ayu, 31 years old. I'm from Ghana. Was born in France. Grew up most of the time in Ghana. That's why I started to play football when I was young. Most of my youth football was in Ghana. Then I came to France in the Academy of Marseille. That's where everything really started. And then I became a professional footballer, thanks to Allah. And then things moved from there. Well, um, my father had a big influence in, in my career. Not only that, also in, in my personal life. Because he's my idol. He's someone I, I look up to. Uh, someone I have a great uh, admiration for. So I think um, he brought a lot to me. Uh, advice on the game, how to comport yourself, how to be patient, try to make the best decisions, whether to stay in a club, move in a club, etc., etc. You know, I learned so much from him, and I think that if I had the career that I've had till now, he, he has a very, very big, big role in this. Well, um, to be to be honest, um, Al Sadd is a club I know and that I followed for a long time because my father played here. This is the club that gave him the opportunity to leave to leave Ghana. So it's a club that uh, I I always followed. I followed the players who played here. Always big players from Raoul, Mamadou Nyang, Kadek Keita, etc., etc. You know, a lot of players played played for for this great club. So it's a club I always followed. And then, um, you know, as soon as um, I had the, the call that El Sad was, was interested, um, straight away, you know, it was a very good idea for me, because for me, it's the, it's the best club in the, in the golf. You know, I watch, I watch the, them play, I watch the style of play. And for me, it's the, it's the best club here. And also, it's a club which I have a personal history with due to, to my father. It's a club which I've followed since I was, I was young because my father always followed what the club did, the results, etc. So it's, it was not a, a information that took me by surprise. I was very, very happy and proud. But it's true, I had to take some time to, to think because I had a few offers from different, whether in the Gulf or in, in Europe. So I had to take my time and, and make, make the right decision. But as soon as uh, I spoke to, to the boss, the coach, Xavi, um, I knew that this was the, the right place for me for, for my future. And then I took the decision to, to come and everything went, went fast. Well, everything is great. Um, I feel good. The, the players made me feel good. Um, everybody here is free. Um, speaking to all the guys who, who have been here for, for a long time, you know, they all accommodated me well. They, they, they put me straight into, into the family. And for me, that was very, very important because I feel before you can be able to to produce on the field what you can do, you have to feel good. And the guys are making me feel, feel welcome. I, and I want to thank them for, for the welcome that they gave me. You know, I'm still getting to know everybody, getting to know how training is going, the tactics, what the coach um, really wants. But uh, I'm very sure that everything will be, will be fine. Everything is going on well. You know, it's a, it's a process. Um, 
and I'm in the process, but what I've seen so far has been great. The training has been great. The, the fun and joy in between the, the players is, is great. You know, I'm happy. I'm happy and for me, this is what is important. The rest now is for me to, to get to my 100% and then deliver on the field. When you play for Al Saad, you know what is there, you have to win everything. So we will try and do what we did last season. That's to win every trophy. And then um, I think next, next year towards the end, we will have the chance to start the Champions League and then we'll, we'll take it from there, but we take it step by step. And for me, now what is important is to continue on what, what we've started. And hopefully I can be part of the, the winning team also this season, inshallah. Try and, um, you know, win the maximum games and bring trophies to the club and try and prepare for for the big one, which is the Champions League. I think um, from what I've seen, it's, it's great. It's top class. I think Qatar is more than ready for this World Cup. They have the stadiums, they have the training facilities, they have the hotels. There is everything here for the World Cup to go perfectly. So I know that it's going to be a great World Cup. And then I hope that we will qualify and that I will be able to, to play the World Cup in, in my home in Doha. My last words for the Jamhur is I will give everything that I have for the team and we will do everything to make sure we keep bringing trophies, to make you proud, happy and inshallah by the end of this season we will all enjoy like how we enjoyed last season. And now, I'm in Al-Sadr. <laughs>